Hello guys, I want to show you how to manage items in this game. Uh, many people do post pictures like this, where they have a big uh, stash, which is filled with uh, random crap, and they cannot do anything, because for example, there is r uh, some remote cannon somewhere here, and they cannot get there, because they have too many items. So what, what they do, they just uh, embigger this uh, this touch and they have even bigger prob problem i want to show you how i do uh, manage items but first let me show you that on the left side i have uh, six uh, hatch and there are eight stacks of resources um, on right side i have factory i can put to factory 12 stacks of resources. So even if I put, you know, next to next to it, uh, this uh, more hatch, it's gonna be usually it's gonna be less efficient that factory than factory because in factory I can store, uh, you know, 12 stacks, but also they they are full stacks. On the left side we can see here is six metal, here is five metal. They didn't connect because between them is uh, explosive, and also. Um, here I have to put walls because otherwise uh, resources will fill my uh, ship so that's not an option so I need to have these walls these stacks are not efficient and factory is way more space efficient so now I can grab this item put it here and you know I, I can save a lot of space Okay, here is remote cannon, which is nice. Um, okay, so basically when you try to make, uh, clean your mess, you should build more factories because you can walk through them and also basically they are more efficient, like, I don't know, two times more efficient when it comes to space. So yeah, I recommend this way when you start. But also there is a trick, bug, abuse, exploit, I don't know how you want to call it, but when you <coughs> when you have factory, you can eject item, and then it appears here. But if you eject one uh, more times, it will wait until there is space to, you know, to put another item. So I can grab this item, and next metal does appear, but I don't have to grab it. It can lay here for forever, and now I can put in this factory infinite amount of uh, resources. So I just will grab some metal, and as you can see, I can put it here, now eject, and metal disappeared. As you can see on this picture, there is just too much metal. If you, you can put it to factory, and at this point, you don't need as big, you know, stash of items uh, because you have sto uh, everything stored here. Okay, there is also explo, but explosive is less um, problematic because you will use it for uh, for production, ammo production. So there is no problem. Okay, um, and when there is a different item like not resources oh here is package to red again i have this inventory which many people try to make and now i have problem because there is some garbage item i don't want it i have again let's look at this picture i have too much metal there is no point in storing to red so i want to shred it but i cannot shred because there is wall so now i have to spend time you know, throw this shredder, take two red, and now I can shred it. It's not, again, it's like waste, some waste of time clicks because you have first take your item, throw it, and you know, you know it's problematic. And also when you try to make your stash even bigger, then you will not be able to reach this item, you know. So, so it's gonna be a problem. Okay. So this is a trick with eject. You should usually make just uh, this trick with metal. 
and put your explosive right away to factory. Here is my main layout. As you can see, I have ladder and I have hatches here. Um, I don't have wall between me and, and these items, so I can shred them easily. I don't have to, you know, uh, take, take them away from hatch and then throw it and, uh, and destroy them later. I can uh, right away destroy them if I want. Also, I have my factories built in, in a way that I can put items from this ladder. So I sit here and I can reach any of this factory, this freeze. Here I put metal because I want to get rid of uh, metal. Here I have some garbage, so I take shredder, remove it. Okay, when I get explore, I just put it to factory. Okay, if, if I have item which I like and I want to, you know, store for later use, I will just throw it because uh, you want to keep uh, some kinds of ammo if you use it and you want to destroy rest. Uh, as you can see, items will not spawn until uh, I take, you know, I take this metal, there is new item. But if you try to make this hatch taller, they're gonna, they gonna start to <coughs> not, be, not be stable because when you have like two items on each other, they are stable, but when you put three hatches, they are four items, they start to moving and they can, you know, move around and then um, they're gonna be in position where they spa start spawning more items. So this is my layout. Uh, it's quite simple. I, I built this for presentation purpose, but uh, normally I have here two ammo, uh, two ammo factories and uh, on the right I have dump factories. So this is <coughs> unlimited, you know, I can store here unlimited metal. Here I store Explo, but I uh, nonstop uh, produce sniper ammo. So each sniper ammo or whatever ammo you want. So it drops here. I use the gravity, you know, here is just big uh, storage area where I store uh, um, ammo and maybe remote cannons and not, nothing else pretty much because garbage I, I remove uh, on spot. Okay, and as you can see, you can grab items through the wall. So I can stand here and take this metal, put it to this factory where I produce uh, repair. I can grab repair and use it. And also I'm in this space so I can use helm uh, very easily. Steering wheel, I don't know how to pronounce it. Okay, and uh, so this is a glitch where which you can abuse and it should solve your problem with storage. And as you can see, I have very small storage and it's I store everything here, infinity metal and here explo. I think you don't need more than uh, three factories with, uh, with ammo <coughs> because you're not gonna have enough, enough you know, explo to keep up. I want to show you one more glitch, which uh, which I don't think it's useful. I used it mostly because I I had here a lot of sniper ammo, so I had to put it away to build this presentation. So when you put ammo to the turret and you uh, release it, they're gonna drop here. They are surrounded by wall, so I can, you know, store as much ammo as I want. It's not that useful because you have to, you know grab this ammo, put it in, and it's not that easy to do. So let me remove one block and I will show you how much ammo I have there. I use this trick uh, mostly when I want to, when it's really, really late game and I have just too many uh, remote turrets. You can see I can store them uh, as well. Okay, I removed this and I see, as you can see, there was a lot of sniper ammo inside. And one more <laughs> thing, when you put this uh, metal inside factory and eject it, 
it's if you destroy this factory it will spawn uh, this all metal at once and you will you can kill your ship by doing this so be careful don't remove this block and don't remove this factory where you put your all your, your all metal okay i think um, that's all if you want if you don't want to uh, use glitch then use at least factories try to keep them in your hand range so you don't have to walk and if you one more thing if you are too far from factory just throw throw stuff don't don't do something like this you know uh, i want to move this repair for example somewhere here don't walk here and and put it down just throw it down and then later just again just like this throw stuff around especially when you have factory for example here don't take it don't go there just throw a lot of metal and then it's easier you know to grab once again here is small uh, there is small dis distance also that's the reason i built my factories with ammo on top because stuff does drop down so i can get the sniper ammo anywhere here and when it builds up i have like very nice uh, here filled uh, storage with ammo and i can grab it easily from this ladder or this ladder because later i will you know uh, expand my ship on 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 the bottom so this storage will be bigger okay that's all i think it should solve many many your inventory problems if you have one like this just use your dump to eject metal and then yeah you you will be in a nice better spot see ya